So the news broke today. The news that the Steelers are pursuing Ryan Jensen in free agency. Sorry, I couldn't get this out earlier. By the time you're seeing this, the news broke yesterday because there's a lot happening. Again, my apologies. But the first thing this tells me is they're probably going to try to rebuild this O-line through free agency. And when I say O-line, I'm really targeting in on that center position with guys like Ben Jones and Ryan Jensen. That's what I am expecting personally, because center isn't the flashiest position. It's more of a get your job done type position, and just that's it. It's not flashy. It's very low key. And that's why if the Steelers can pull off getting a guy like Ryan Jensen, <laughs> you know, it, it's going to be pretty big, you could say, like JC Jackson type signing big. And I mean that because now Kevin Dotson gets structure on that line. He's in the middle of the line and he's giving you leadership. So does Dan Moore. So does basically everybody on that line, including the guard and right tackle you're probably going to draft. Of course, we're definitely drafting a guard. I mean, let's just be completely realistic here. Whether it's Sean Ryan, whether it's Eddie Ingram, we're going to get young guys on that line this draft. So getting Ryan Jensen would be probably the most important signing if i had to guess throughout this offseason if we're able to pull that off here's another thing to think about the cap space will the steelers want to spend that money we haven't throughout the past couple of years so i don't know if we will this year but all i'm gonna say is ryan jensen would be a great investment you failed to do it by yourself you failed to build that o-line by yourself and rebuild that offense throughout three years think it's about time you should start spending money and if you're gonna spend money go ahead and do it on the o-line imagine what Najee would do with ryan jensen just one elite o-lineman because he hit 1200 yards with scraps i mean that's very impressive in itself but yeah i think he would go off like 1600 1700 yards with a guy like jensen anyway let me know what you guys think and i'll see you guys on the next one peace